In previous tutorials about React, we considered how we can install React on our computer and we downloaded Node.js and uh, used some commands like npm start or React create app or React DOMs. But in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how we can use React application without uh, using npm packages just by using CDN in your HTML file. Let's go and consider it. First of all, we create a HTML file and uh, a basic HTML and uh, edit it with, for example, any editor, uh, for example, like uh, VS Code. Okay. If we consider this simple HTML, index.html, you can see that we have some tags, HTML, head, body, and uh, title. Okay. For using CDNs, uh, we can insert some lines here. But what is a CDN? CDN is a content delivery network, refers to a geographically distributed group of servers which work together to provide fast delivery of internet content and a CDN allows for the quick transfer of assets needed for loading internet content including HTML pages or JavaScript files, a style sheet, images and videos. It's uh, a brief explanation of uh, CDN. In our file, when we go to index.html, we can add uh, three lines for using uh, React libraries and also JavaScript compiler to our file. Okay, I paste this course here. The first line refers to a react development.js and other is for react DOM and the third one is for using bubble compiler okay after it we go to body tag and use a div use a div for using these libraries okay by default, its name is root, and we should have uh, this div like this, and then uh, we use a script tags. Okay. Just pay attention that you should uh, use this script, and uh, in its type, you should determine that it's uh, a kind of babel. Okay. And then we can uh, write our React uh, uh, applications. For example, here I'm going to use a simple class as a component. And here inside this script tag, I paste my code. This class is a kind of component. Its name is app and extends react.component and uh, render this line and we expect in our browser we see hello world it's a very simple component and in the next level we should uh, render this dom and use this component by this comment for example react dom dot render we call the app name here, the class name, the component name app, and then we use document dot get element by id root that refers to this uh, div. Okay. Now we save it and go to our browser. Yes, as you can see, index HTML file uh, displays this. Hello world. This way of application development gives us a basic understanding of the main building blocks how to develop a React application. I hope this tutorial will be useful for you. If you enjoyed, please like, subscribe and share this video with your friends. Thank you.